I like Air Force laying 10 and a half in Colorado Springs against Wyoming. Um, I, I think this is an Air Force team that maybe they had, they had looked a little bit, I guess they got one of the CIC games next week. Uh, they got, they go to, they go to Annapolis and they play Navy, but this Air Force team drilled San Diego state a couple of weeks ago. And if you'll, you'll look at Wyoming, they've given up a lot of yards on the ground. Yeah. Like, usually Craig ball teams don't give up a ton of ground, a ton of yards on the ground, but they gave up, I think over seven yards of carry against New Mexico. Uh, there was someone else. They gave up a, uh, App, App State, they gave up over 200 yards on the ground. I, I, I don't know. It, it feels like you had a team that's won a couple of games already as an underdog outright. So how sustain – either it tells you one yeah. or two things. Either the market is completely under, underestimating Wyoming or the market has it right and they've just kind of exceeded expectations and won a couple of games that they probably shouldn't. And that ultimately is going to kind of come back to the mean. So uh, I'm going to lay the uh, the 10 and a half here with Air Force because I think his offense is really, really good. Good spot to fade Wyoming off a win against Fresno State. Um, in the win against Fresno State and the upset against Texas Tech, they scored, I believe, zero second half touchdowns in those four quarters. <laughs> they obviously scored, I think, a touchdown against Texas Tech in overtime. Right. But the second half of these games, they have not scored. So uh, Air Force, sneaky good defense, by the way. Yep. They, last season, this season as well. Um, so I like that wager there. All right, I'm going to the Pac-12 Conference as usual. If I lose another game on my best <laughs> bet, the way I lost UCLA first half last weekend, I'm I might not give any wages anymore. I, I don't know how you, I, I don't I UCLA was up six driving in for a touchdown, field goal, anything, just fall on the on the ball and they and they cover the first half. So they threw a pick six, a pick six bear. All right, I'm going back to UCLA actually. Oregon State uh, is hosting UCLA. I'm taking the under here at 54 and a half. You have two teams that want to run the football. You have two teams that want to protect their quarterbacks and their offense. You have Dante Moore for UCLA. If you watch that game, they, they don't, just don't really trust him on offense. Like they, 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 they yeah. it, it, like they don't, they don't trust him on offense. So I, I don't expect him to do well in a raucous crowd again. Corvallis hard to a place hard to win at. Both teams protect Carson Steele. Bruin right had thirty carries last weekend. Like they're trying to run the football. So is Oregon State. Uh, UCLA's defense number two, I believe, in points per drive. Their, their havoc rate is, is 11th. Like, they, they hit the quarterback. They have tackles for loss. I just see a slow, grinded-out game. Give me the under here in Corvallis. The only, only thing that I would worry about in this game is what we just we mentioned. Don't really trust Dante Moore. Has had a couple of pick sixes already. Yeah, too, yeah. And DJU is certainly capable of giving it to the other team as well. I, I, if you, <laughs> but if you don't get... Yeah. Non-offensive touchdown here. I really like that. Yes, that, that, that does scare me because Dante Moore, again, two straight games, pick sixes. Um, yeah, that would – if that happens again, Bear, you just cursed me. You know, you just cursed me again, didn't you? I did. Just, you just cursed my, my best I, bet. I, I, I did. <sighs> At least I didn't wear purple. I yeah. actually thought about that when I woke up this morning and I said, do I, want, do, I want, do, I want, do I want to be that guy and wear purple to upset my co-host? Or not? I said, no, I'm going to be – You should have said that to troll me. No, you, okay. you're nice. You 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 bring me breakfast here. I do. Every, yes, a nice New York bagel. When, when Hopefully, I that, that karma leads to a win this weekend. It does. Bear bets full episodes drop twice a week right here on the Bear Bets YouTube channel. Remember to subscribe to stay ahead of the odds, and let's celebrate all of our wins together.